and sleep, dreams, space, and time. All illusion is nothing tangible because when it's all over, everyone ends up the same cold and alone, sleeping listless in their graves and their dreams. Well, he thinks they dream of heaven, perceptions of the blissful kingdom, huge white clouds and cherry blossoms for some, or a spacious darkened room with a desk in a corner to write endless praise. Maybe books stacked so high you could never finish. Eternity Day, Wolf Whitman, Kerouac, or whoever the hell else you wanted to explore through type. And for him, well, maybe a lovely oak drafting table with limitless paper and unlimited medium. And the books, they would be nice to create by day, read by midnight, and when he turned off both, he could see his friends. They'd say what they never could cry, if need be, without ridicule, a clean, genuine existence, have it pure. And during their lives, nothing came true, all bets were off. And the more they planned, the more they failed. And during their lives, all they saw were angry faces everywhere. Was angry, they all seemed angry. The whole world was angry. He's not angry, he's just sad.